swords. I'm empty. The eyeball is that here. goes. for you should make your battles to the death end that much quicker. Moving right along. Thanks. 
sides. You wouldn't hang with me given the choice. I thought I had you sorted, man, but maybe you just don't appreciate the finer things. Still mates, right, Dionysus? Now he's angry. I gotta hand it to you, man. Let's liven things up. Soul-sucking butterflies. Thanks. Olympus, I accept this message.
perfect. Chariots. Not yet. You've been such a reish. Wait, you don't have to give me something in return. It was a gift. Though, you're insisting, aren't you? I don't know what to say, mate. Here's the fee. Hey, what's uh, with that Kron man? He's sort of, I don't know. Though I am glad he's been of service. 
One more step toward the light of day, so long as I am here. Two against one. Seems hardly fair. Ah, oh, well. Let's kill him and be done, King. Theseus? The Bull of Minos? You two are legends. I'd be honored if we had a sporting contest here. Ah, a naked attempt to sway me from my convictions. Defend yourself, you blackguard. And may the gods show you some mercy, for I shall not. Your slouching form is but a laughing stock compared to my superior technique. Don't do that. Nothing like tracking before an audience. It's rather hard. What? Wow, I can't believe you took on the Minotaur. No way! No wonder you're back here. Everyone knows that he's unstoppable, especially me. Hey, next you run into him, could you get his autograph for me? No. I wonder what jobs the house contractor has available. He's back already, Cerberus. Just as I indicated. I'm standing right here, father. I'm sorry he disturbed your rest again, Cerberus. You've done a good job. The realm is well defended still to the high standard that you set. You keep an eye on father for me, boy. Don't let him sour up everyone's mood. <laughs> Cerberus promises. Look what I got for you, boy. As one of Cerberus's heads receives the prince's gift. Thank you, boy.
no time to rest. list of minor prophecies. That sounds somewhat exciting, I suppose. You requisitioned that useless bit of parchment. House contractor, my good shade, I've yet another job for your distinguished team. What is it do you think that shall achieve? commitments to this house, Megara. There is no shame in yours. I understand. It's just... Am I supposed to keep pretending nothing's changed? This house is cracking at the seams, and no one's going to admit it? The house shall stand eternally. Although in what condition, it is ours to decide. Our obligation is to keep the house in order. I know. You're right. Of course, you're right. I'll do my best. I'll do my best for both our sakes, Nix. What was that about? I'd ask you to join me for a drink, Lada, but I know you've a task ahead of you, and liquor dulls the senses. Fortunately so, under most circumstances except yours. Leave me to it, will you? And I'll have one for the both of us. Some other time, Achilles. Just checking in on... What's new? The lounging area within the House of Hades is a dismal place to be. It's better than nothing. That must be the fated list. I want to go lie down. My extended family seems an interesting lot. Prince perhaps believes it was through his own choice that he procured the fated list of minor prophecies, but it was preordained. Oh no, not this determinism thing again. It is the dead of night, or the approximation of it in the realm of Hades. Prince of the Underworld, Zagreus, rises from a fitful slumber with much mischief on his mind. Mischief? Me? I was just going to have a little look through Father's stuff. All is quiet at this time. Ever-dreaming Hypnos put a spell upon the house, as Wilful Zagreus had asked of him. All are fast asleep, save for the Prince. It is exactly as he planned. Lower your voice, old man. I'm trying to be sneaky here. He ventures toward the stately throne of his Lord Father, half expecting to be caught, but ill expecting what he is about to find. 
I said shut up, old man. He does not know exactly what he seeks. He only knows that something always has felt off to him. That he does not belong. Who is he, really? Lord Hades never would indulge such questions. So Prince Zagreus would find out for himself. I'm not listening. He rifles through his Lord Father's possessions. There is not much of any import there. Ledgers and administrative parchment work. Correspondence from Olympus which he had ignored. No trace of any reference to his son. But then, there is the note. Written finally in a hand and voice the likes of which the prince had never seen or heard. Hades, I can no longer tolerate my life here in this place. So I'm leaving, even if it kills me. I won't be returning to Olympus. If there is a place where I belong in this world, it must be somewhere between heaven and hell. Perhaps it's on the coast and has a little garden. Take care of Cerberus. I shall miss him. Persephone. Thus did Prince of the Underworld Zagreus absorb the contents of this hidden letter, written in his mother's hand. His mother's hand? My mother's hand? Wait, what? You're saying this Persephone, that she's my mother? But father always said that Nyx was m that liar. He lied to me. They both did. All my life. Uh, thus did the prince discover inadvertently the well-kept truth about his lineage. Entirely by chance, this did occur. Persephone, the one-time queen of all the underworld. Where had she gone? And why? Engulfed by newfound questions and his rage, the prince decided to confront his lord and master. You... why? You... you're... Nix, you're not my mother. All this time, you and my father, you... you lied to me? Oh, my dear child. So now you know. So now you know, but only half the truth. I can explain the rest, so please. It never was my wish to hurt you. Mother, I wonder, will you even remember me? Can't sleep. What's going on, Skelly? Gotta say, you're really getting somewhere, boy. Oh, I'm pretty impressed here. And they don't even... Appreciate the vote of confidence, mate. Maybe you're right, and someday I'll get out of here. <laughs> That's a good one. No, probably not. Wasn't anything in the old contract about that. Huh. New keepsake. Tartarus, strong enough to seal away the Titans, but not me. 